Hey everyone, welcome back to Roblox Finder. In today's video, we will be telling you guys exactly how you can download the Roblox Studio for free. Now most of you guys would already have a pretty good idea of what Roblox Studio is and why you might need to download it, but for those who don't, it's basically the building tool of Roblox that helps you create the places you want to explore. Roblox Studio allows you to test your games in an isolated environment before uploading them to Roblox website. It provides the Roblox developers with a comprehensive set of tools, giving them greater sense of control and creative expression. Roblox Studio has a huge variety of features, and it doesn't matter if you're an amateur developer or an experienced programmer. It is a must-have tool if you're into Roblox game development. Okay, now let's get down to business and take a look at how you can download Roblox Studio for free. Basically, the first step you have to take is to go to your preferred internet browser, like Google Chrome, and simply enter roblox.com into the address bar to navigate to the Roblox website. Once you're on the Roblox website, you have to sign into your Roblox account. After signing in, you'll have to click on the Roblox Developer Resources section, and there you'll be able to see the Roblox Studio overview. Alternatively, you can simply search for Roblox Studio on Google, and the first search result that you'll see will be that of the Roblox website. Currently, it says Roblox Studio is free. You simply have to click on that. Once you go there, you will see a button that says start creating. Now don't worry, clicking on that button won't immediately throw you into Roblox Studio's create session. It's simply Roblox's cool way of telling you that you can download the Roblox Studio here. So basically, once you click on that button, it will give you an option to either close that window or to download the Roblox Studio. You have to click on the download studio button to get started. It will take a few minutes to download and eventually Roblox Studio will be downloaded and ready to install. Now you might be wondering what exact specifications should your computer have so that Roblox Studios works properly. Well, as you know, Roblox does not have the most advanced graphics in the world, so it does not require very advanced computer specifications or anything. You could download Roblox Studio to your Windows PC or to your Mac. It supports both and works fine on both. As far as minimum system requirements are concerned, you need to have at least one gigabyte of system memory and internet access. If your computer is able to run Roblox properly, it will be able to run Roblox Studio with ease. You can further enhance your Roblox Studio experience if you have a three button mouse with a scroll wheel, which almost every mouse today has, and a dedicated video card. So once you've downloaded Roblox Studio, you will simply have to open the downloaded file and it will give you an option to install it. Simply install the Roblox Studio and there you have it. You have your very own Roblox Studio absolutely free. You can use it to make cool games like Jailbreak, Adopt Me, Natural Disaster Survival, and others. Obviously, if you're a new Roblox developer, you won't be able to make such high quality games straight away. It will take you some time, but eventually you'll get there if you work really hard. Let's take this opportunity to familiarize you with Roblox Studio a bit, as it can be a little confusing at the start. So basically, the Roblox Studio interface that you'll see will have several sections. Just go over each section and understand what each button does. Most prominently, you will see a menu bar, which will have different tabs like the Home tab, the Model tab, the Test tab, the View tab, and the plugins tab. The home tab contains the basic functions necessary for building and testing your game. The model tab contains tools you can use to create detailed models and add advanced objects. The test tab contains tools for gameplay testing. The view tab lets you toggle the various windows of Studio as well as several display features. Last but not least, the plugin tab contains tools for managing different plugins creating animations, configuring localization, and more. This was just a general overview of the menu of Roblox Studio. Now this is in no way a comprehensive tutorial as how you can get started with Roblox Studio. We'll probably be doing another video on that some other day. For now, we hope this video was helpful for you guys in understanding how you can download Roblox Studio for free. We will see you guys in another video. Till then, goodbye.